had a beautiful, colorful Balinese outrigger boats. That's a rather big one. There's a smaller one. Let's check the bow here. Maybe it's a marlin gape. You see the eyes, they are for safe navigation, it can be foggy, it can be shallow waters. I noticed the stern of this one down here, very beautiful I think. You see the rudder there, it's put in the boat. This is Sanur Beach. Sanur Sea, further away is the Pacific Ocean. And here at anchor are about 20 of these, they're called Yukungs. They used to have sails, which is uncommon these days. They have outboards, they go for fishing and maybe fishing with tourists. I sailed one of these many decades ago, very nice. I was going to jibe, I think. I was doing the sailing, I know how to sail some craft. And uh, the skipper stopped me and he said, and he showed me how to do it, otherwise maybe I was going to break the, the mast or the yard. Uh, here is the scrap yard. One, two, three, four hulls and the beams. These beams are made in three parts and they are naturally grown. It takes some seven years. I suppose you you phone the guy who is making the beams and you say, hey, give me beams for one boat this size. And he says, yeah, call me back in seven years. First you have to grow it and then maybe you have to dry it for a while. And then do the final shaping. Yeah. The beautiful outrigger boats of Bali. Here are the guys resting in the... This is the shed for working on the boats. So beautiful, nice Samur beach.